tooth loss and deadly heart disease. The positive effects of brushing and flossing are well established. Gum disease is the most common cause of tooth loss. Gum disease related inflammation plays a role in the narrowing of arteries of the heart. Toothless heart disease patients are nearly twice as likely to die as those who have all their teeth. Dr. Olavidin, a cardiologist at Uppsala University Hospital and Uppsala Clinical Research Center in Sweden, is the lead author of the study. Published in the December 16th issue of the European Journal of Preventive Cardiology. The study included more than 15,000 heart disease patients from 39 countries. They were assessed for tooth loss and followed for an average of 3.7 years. The study found, those with the fewest teeth were, older, smokers, female, less active and more likely to have diabetes, high blood pressure, more body fat and a lower level of education. Every increased level of tooth loss was associated with a 6% increased risk of major cardiovascular events and a roughly 15% higher risk of cardiovascular death, death from any cause and stroke. Compared to patients with all their teeth, those with no teeth had a 27% higher risk of major cardiovascular events. The researchers found loss of tooth was associated with 85% higher risk of cardiovascular death, 81% higher risk of death from any cause, and 67% higher risk of stroke. The increase in risk is gradual, with the highest risk in those with no remaining teeth. The risks of cardiovascular death and all-cause death are almost double to those with all teeth remaining. Heart disease and gum disease share many risk factors such as smoking and diabetes. Tooth loss could be an easy and inexpensive way to identify patients at higher risk who need more intense prevention efforts. Thanks for watching. Please click the link in description for more information.